hardest part about videos are all the stupid little components, like... Me, am I a stupid little component? <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> I know, you're recording? Oh. Yeah. Well, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> All right, everyone, so. What you, this is Dana. Who are they? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do you remember the uh, fucking. Clark's Trading Post, dude, the old guy that would fucking hang out in the woods in his little car? What the fuck was his name? Do you add a comas? Yes. Who's in there? Oh, now you scratch it. Now you scratch Clean it. Come on. Come on. Learn how to use that. It's all about me. <laughs> what, are, what are you doing with that camera? Why, why is it recording? Uh, the videos that get have the best engagement and like long-term fan people, users, are like 20-minute videos. I know it's hard to believe because nobody actually watches so that. So Dana thinks that we need to make a 20 minute video. At minimum, every video should be 20 minutes. No. I'm thinking like a couple minutes just to kind of like showcase what we're doing. But anyways, so everybody, this is Dana. <sighs> Dana's been doing an absolute shit job at like promoting the van. Not even promoting the van, just kind of showing you guys who are, what, who are they though. Oh my way, All right. Anyways, I so. I think it's a portal to another dimension. <laughs> This is Dana. Dana's special. Hello, Dana's our special hello, friend. Friends. Um, so yeah, Dana's gonna show you kind of what's going on with the van, kind of about the story. It's, it's a spaceship. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a. It's, I, don't mind him. I don't think I could spend any less than twenty minutes talking about each individual piece, but I'll try to keep it really brief. Um, so we've done a lot over the past. I don't know. Really, since like Thanksgiving is when we really dove into this, but. It goes way farther back than that. Um, and the mission <laughs> is to go to Patagonia. Uh, it, it, this whole van isn't completely necessary for that, but for me, it kind of turned into a art and engineering project to build this fucking dream that I have no idea what I'm talking about. There you go, nice <laughs> panel. Important to, when I lose track, just pan away. All right, let's, let's take over out of the van. This is. A Okay, so <laughs> just real, real quick, um, it's a it's a 2018 four-wheel drive Sprinter. We installed these flare spaces, um, one on each side. This one doesn't have a window, which I really fucked up. And they make two different sizes. One's the extended, one's not. If you have a 170, get the extended on both sides. They tell you you can't do it because the slider will interfere. It's not true. You'll, you'll be fine. We changed these windows uh, thanks to. Uh, some 45 caliber rounds that may or may not have went through <laughs> these windows and possibly the side of the van. Dana took a rifle to the side of the windows, just just if you guys didn't know. Pew pew. Do you, do you have any ideas how I can get that window out of the fucking van? I'm gonna try to figure something out today. Well, do a little science. How long is it gonna take you to think about it? Probably 30 seconds. Maybe it just needs a couple more. Uh, about 35 rounds went through. If you look closely, there's still some shrap metal damage. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know those were there. Yeah, I gotta fix that. <laughs> Work in progress. Um, so exterior-wise, really, we've done those two things and if you were to step back, well, let's just come in real quick. The uh, air conditioner, um, which is on the roof, and then the fan, which is on the roof. Exterior-wise, that's pretty much all we've done. Um, not true. <laughs> Underneath the van is a ton of exterior stuff. We have an SBAR D5 hydronics heater directly under my feet. That's under the floor. You can't see it. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so... <laughs> That's a furnace, then we have a fully stainless steel exhaust. I thought we were pausing for a minute. And <laughs> <laughs> um, that is a, a deleted tuned kit. Uh, the main reason for that is because when we go to South America, 
that diesel fuel is crude and it'll ruin the whole death system and actually cause way more problems than it's worth keeping it, so we have to get rid of it. All right, so what we got going on in here, I see some green flooring. Is this your final flooring, Dana? Is this doesn't uh, look very finished. Yeah, I really like green, so I figured this would be, you know, final, final finish, fit finished product. Nah, so this is like a heated floor, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is a company, Warmboard, uh, makes makes this this product. It's a aluminum uh, top. The PEX piping runs through. Uh, this glycol loop runs through this valve body that runs through a heat exchanger under the floor Heats it up the whole floor gets really warm like 160 degrees, which is super nice You can literally lay on this thing and it's like <gasps> Oh, it's glorious um, That same burner powers an on-demand hot water system uh, Which gives me hot uh, warm water at the sink. It gives me warm water at the shower Which is also a wet bath a little self-composting toilet and also will give me hot water at a temp mixture valve at the back of the van so you know super super basic water system <laughs> like super basic uh what else we want to talk about here where are you going do you have a final resting place you don't you, you keep moving on me what are you doing probably gonna turn into stardust stardust i'm gonna sleep like this obviously on a bed of course uh, like that. Whoa. Um, on a bed, it's gonna raise <laughs> on <a> bed. lower. <laughs> um, motors. Crazy. Alright, why do you have holes in the floor? Uh the battery box that we talked about that we didn't actually talk about. This is where my motorcycle back tire is gonna sit, uh, because I don't think any van's complete without a hyper motard. Just my opinion. <laughs> uh, so a motorcycle will be here in a wheel lock and then the tire drops in so the bed can lower down over the motorcycle that will be kind of squatted here all like Arr. Oh God. Well, so that's kind of where we're at. Dana over here is gonna hopefully start making some more videos for you because it's just been really terrible. Really terrible. We keep trying to get him to do some things so yeah, stay tuned and Danny here is gonna do some stuff for you. <laughs> I was not meant for this whole video thing, huh? <laughs> See ya!